Nimnu Vigamro, they all decided, Talmud Godel, Shemevi Lidei Maisa. Talmud is great because it brings to Maisa. So the Rabbi Mamedai, from this we see that Maisa is Godel. Because the whole reason that Talmud is Godel is because it brings the deed. Sabazun that Allah said, Love it says Taka that Maisa will be Godel. Rabbi brings it now, Yem Yem. Hey, Tavis. Yeah, they say learning is great. Ah? We understand mice is greater, but they say learning is greater. Right. They say learning is greater, but the reason they give is because it brings to mice. Heist says that the ultimate goal is mice. Yeah, My, why don't they just say that? Avasisiv. Avasisiv, yeah. Adorten, nem menoch echa. Yeah, by deeds a person takes higher. Yeah. The mice is as a. The Maise is that Asha Talmud, Talmud Godel is, because now what we're doing is we're Poshet learning the Inyonim as we will fulfill it. Visham Nasel of Anachak Mitzvah Sitzenacha will fulfill the Mitzvah and Tachlas Hashlemos. The ultimate goal of fulfillment of Mitzvah is in the redemption. So the Mela now is the Inyan of Tziyunim that the Ramban brings in Krishna in, uh, in Pasha Voschanan or Ekev, I think in, in Ekev. Benegea, the Madita Mesam as Benechem. It brings over the Santam as Varai al Vavchem al Nafshem that this is, you're placing my words, Meshur Abbein is telling Jewish nation on your heart, he says, this is a, a marking that to, pre to prepare for their redemption, because in the redemption will fulfill them in, 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 the, in the highest level, most ultimate level that can be. As the, the Rebbe Marash says in a Maimer, the Marash says in Teros Chaim, the Mitra the Rebbe says in Vaychi, that now the person, even in time based image, was not in the Tachlas Hashlemus, was not in the ultimate completion. Come lost love, so then the, the person will be Bishlemus, the behemoth will be Bishlemus. So it says, Bechal, the whole, uh, the side of the person, inside the animal, everything will be on a higher level. So many of them mitzvahs will be fulfilled in the, in the highest level. In other words, not, not, not only there is under oath. But they also teach him. And Nochmera, they teach him also everything that relates to, in a practical sense. Begimolo Amudem Anal, everything that relates to the three concepts of studying Teda and uh, prayer and doing mitzvahs, which includes everything. Gimelos Chasadim includes all the, the, the 613 mitzvahs. Begimolo Amudem Anal, the the three above mentioned pillars on what the world stands. Shal Yidei Zayi Oelam Eimet Vekayom, Hainabeifan Shal Kayom. Through this, the world will be standing and, and existing. This is constantly uh, uh, there, in a, in a solid way. Now the Rebbe begins explaining these three in Yonim and what it, how it relates to a person in this physical world that is so descended in this low world, which is the world we find ourselves in. <coughs> to understand all this, we need to explain uh, to introduce the Nigel Kedei Lekayim Shleishin Yonim Meilot Tzarech Adam Asha Adam Amekayim and Yibin Neshama Begufay Lamazel. In order to fulfill the three Yonim, a person that fulfills it needs to be a Neshama, a soul, in a body in this physical world. Okay, now Shatayron Nitna Las Yedi Las Yisholem Beilam Teira was given in order to make peace in the world, which Derech Agav the Rebbe mentions it before from the Rambam. It's interesting. Did, did, where does the Rambam write it? In the Alochus of Hanukkah. What is the situation there? He says, if the Marshal, he has natives, he has enough candles, he has sufficient candles only for one of the other, Shabbos or, or Hanukkah. So he says, use it for Shabbos. Because it's union of Shalom Bayis, so to peace in the, the household, and it is to, and Taylor was given to make peace in the world. So what so in Tasant, where does he, where does he stress the mile of Shabbos in the Alochas of Hanukkah? And this is how he signs off the Alochas of Hanukkah. This is the last line. This is the final line, the punchline of all the Alochas of Hanukkah that Shabbos stands higher. Okay, Pashtus so Inyan. Shanishama Nishama is begufe Imam de Bamatan Tera. The Nishama since their body stood by Matan Tera. At Mount Sinai. They kibla satayra and they receive the tayra. V'hainu b'chdei k'dei d'chdei shah nishama t'malish nichusa ba'elam liyas ha'elam emet va'elam kayam tzricha nishama leira del islabes b'guf. In order that the nishama should fulfill her shlichas, that the world should stand and the world should exist, the nishama has to come down the nishama b'guf. 
Hine, so now the question is why? Hine, binyan, you read the Sanashama the Mata, you do Ashai Lebaze, you read the Zulama. Why do we need this descent? It's interesting, a new Mata Mokim in our 16. Megala Mukes, and the Nochtanya Rish Pati Pediklamad Hei. Which is the Nechama for the Bainanim, a consolation for the Bainanim, why they have to struggle every day with the, with the evil inclination. This is in Tanya Rish Pediklamad Hei, but the Megala Mukes is a new Mata Mokim. When we say the word Yerida, which means descent, so this is an expression from our Tera, which is true Tera. And surely, definitely, it is accurate. From this we understand, The arrival, the descent, the, the arrival of the Nishama, the entering of the nishama of the body into the, in closing the self into the soul is a descent, which means it's not just passing through the soul. This is the difference, as Chassidus explains, between mavir and islapshus. <coughs> mavir means something which just goes through the channel, but is not changed, not acclimated to it, and it just goes further, goes to the next station. Shasa, but if something is mislabish, it means it's enclosed in it, it's, in effect, it's affected by it, and, it's, it, and, it, and it gains a deep connection with the Inyan that it encloses itself in. The same thing is the Nishama Beguf. Nishama enclosed in the Guf, although the Nishama is higher than time and place, but then it is considered already a limitation, a restriction for the Nishama. And as the Rebbe brings in a Maimer, the Rebbe brings in a Maimer that the Nishama in a, a, is considered a likus as a likus became a nivra. It's considered godliness as godliness became a creation. In other words, it's, 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 it's already an entity. It's an entity, it's an ishama. It's already doing a certain function. It's an ishama which is machaya, which is sustaining the goof, a certain body. Or as a vart, which I saw at Mamish again a few days ago, we mentioned it in the, in the past, that the Rebbe, the, the, it wasn't the Rebbe, it was Chassidim in Russia, said a word, he said it first, in, I'll say it first in Yiddish, and then translate it. He says that, genommen a chelik von sich, und abgesundet von sich, und er seht sich, wie es ist nicht sich. He took something of him, separated from him, and he sees himself not as himself. This means the neshama. He took the neshama, chelik elekam emal mamash, as the Alter Rebbe says, mamash, literally part of Hashem, and separated from himself that it should become a nivro, a creation, and he sees, and he sees, the Vartis says, he sees himself as not himself. In other words, he sees that this is already a creation. He does not see the essence of as it was before, it's already a new entity. It's a, it's a creation. It's a creature. <coughs> a spiritual creature, but it's a it's a, it's a Yerida. There was a change in the quality of the Nishama. And especially when we say the union of Yerida, when if somebody says you descend, it doesn't mean literally you went down a, a staircase. It means that it, 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 in a spiritual sense, it had a spiritual impact, the, 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 grade, the grading in the, in, the, in the Nishama. So the Rebbe asked the question, Why did they wish to make this? This is, a, the, this is the expression, the way the Alter Rebbe says it in the Teira. <coughs> the, asking the question <coughs> in such a wording, in such a phrase. Why did Hashem make it? That the enclosure of the Nishama in the body should be dafka in the way of a descent. And the answer for that is known, and this is uh, on the order 17. It says, a see in the Teira. Which in the Kutetera is a Yeridah Tzedah Chaliyah. This is basically the, the whole question. is a question that starts in the Kutetera. Why did the Neshama descend the matter? The Yeridah Tzedah Chaliyah. Hai no she'ein ha Yeridah k'dei sheti shoi ram me Neshama be matzav shal Yeridah me madrigosa chas v'sholim. The Yeridah, the descent, is not in order. That the Neshama should just remain there. There's no, 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 no accomplishment there. As the Rebbe brings Bechlal from, ta- from Tereir, Parsha Vayeshev, other places, that this is like a businessman. And Nishama comes on this world as 